Uh, next up in the GMA Heat Index, the Pixie Cut, Hollywood's favorite new look. It was everywhere at the Met Ball this week, so we asked ABC's Abby Boudreau to go in search of the perfect Pixie Cut. Here's a look. It was a hair showdown at the Met Gala in New York City. From Sarah Jessica Parker's elaborate headpiece and Nicole Richie's short white coif to Anne Hathaway's shocking platinum locks, it's what's on top of your head that's getting the double take. The cropped hairdo is taking red carpets by storm. It doesn't matter whether your haircut costs $15 or $500, you can get the look. Inspiring, yes. According to a recent poll conducted by the Hairdressing Council of Great Britain and Universal Pictures, Anne Hathaway's perfect pixie she donned in Les Mis was named the most influential on-screen haircut of all time. But Anne isn't the only one to go short. Charlize Theron, Michelle Williams, Emma Watson, Halle Berry, Viola Davis all know how to make it look feminine, powerful, and gorgeous. LA celebrity stylist Chris McMillan, famous for creating Jennifer Aniston's Rachel back in the 90s, and Miley Cyrus's recent cropped cut says anyone with a lot of confidence can pull off the pixie. It just needs to be shaped correctly for that face shape. You know, little tweaks here and there, a little longer in the bang, or maybe a little shorter in the bang. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Wafiqua Basrai, a tax accountant in California, taking a cue from Anne Hathaway, so wants to here? go from long and luxurious to you short to and haircut. sassy. I've always actually liked drastic haircuts, so I figure now's the time. Here we go. Here's her before. And take a look at her now. Wow. You like it? I do. It's so short. Yeah. Wow. You got the pixie cut. It's awesome. It's so, so dramatic. It's really edgy. And it's fun. I like it. And just a few days later, do you feel like you achieved that Anne Hathaway look? I think so, a little bit. I mean, you know, no one's going to rock it like Anne Hathaway, but. <laughs> oh, you're rocking it, girl. <laughs> but if you're not quite ready to take the plunge, Say goodbye to my long hair. There are other ways to test the trend first. And just maybe, shorter is better. All right, so what do you think, guys? Do you think that this <laughs> is well, the new me? I think that's... Pixie Cut just died. Yeah, I feel like that's kind of over. funky. That's Linda that's Evangelista, over. 1993. <laughs> I mean, that's that's different from a Pixie Cut. Oh, what a specific <laughs> reference. Right. <laughs> different. It's a little spunky, a little punky. Yeah. I feel kind of confident, though, I got to tell you. Robin, I know you know what I'm talking about. Absolutely. Sure, maybe better. I don't know if this is you know, you, you look I don't great know if this is my full-time look. You, you can, you oh, can pull yeah. it off, Abby. Yeah, you can pull I'm not off. so sure. Thank you. Is it Abby or is it? <laughs> All right. Yeah, or is that Linda? So you know, if it was Linda, she wouldn't be up right now. No. Not 94, <laughs> no, 1993. But I am looking forward to my hair growing out a little bit more on top, especially. And it's just kind of great. Yeah, I'm really excited that. about it. Mm, yeah, spiky, like kind of the Halle Berry edgy, kind of. Halle Berry thing. Yeah, kind of like you. Like, yeah, right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mine's more Miley. This is more Miley. I wish you could hear all the conversations that we were having during it, though. It really does spark a conversation. Because you had it for a while. I had short hair for a long time. I look like flock of seagulls. It wasn't good. <laughs> but we tried, people. We tried.